one who fasts Stand up in prayer at night And Allah will forgive Allah will forgive Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen Al-Qa'il fi muhkam al-Tanzeel إن الله وملائكته يصلون على النبي يا أيها الذين آمنوا صلوا عليه وسلموا تسليما My dear respected brothers and sisters in Islam السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته And I ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to accept your fasting and to accept your good deeds in this month inshaAllah and make this month as the month of barakah for all of you and for all the Muslims around the universe. My dear respected brothers and sisters, before we go to uh, the topic, I'd like to go back to the night of power and remember why Rasulullah forgot when the day and the time for that night of power because there were two brothers they were in the masjid and they had a dispute they were fighting they have an argument or whatever reason so then we are all human we all make mistakes we all have our differences but if we have some obstacles or some dispute we should just stop not to talk to each other just fight each other and that's it no Islam has some input for that in the very same masjid, you won't find people, subhanAllah, they're there just, they care about nothing but ibadat, worship, do good deeds. Wallah, I remember, I will remember, I swear it, one of the, one of the days we were in the masjid for i'tikaf, and subhanAllah, I looked one of the brother, uh, he was praying by himself, he made a sujood, and that sujood took him long time, looks like hours, and he didn't, I watched him like it was kind of dark, the masjid kind of dark, not really that all the light, because you know, uh, uh, night prayer. A sujood took him all night, few hours. He didn't get up till, till he heard a few se seconds before, I mean, probably heard the adhan for the Fajr adhan. So it was Ramadan. He didn't go for suhoor. He just stayed doing uh, one sajda, subhanAllah, because a person sometimes might feel himself connected and he's in the masjid. And some others might be there and they might discuss in issues for this dunya or politics, which is not right. So few brothers, they had dispute among themselves. So there were some difficulties. And what we have to do at this point? At this point, if you're able to make peace between these brothers, it's duty upon you to go and make peace among these brothers and try to solve the pro their problem if you can. And let me, we call this Islah al -bain. And let me report to you a hadith narrated by Rasulullah sallallahu when he said, Ala ukhbirukum bi'afdala min as-siyam? When he said, shall I tell you something better than the siyam? Better than the siyam, the fasting? Better than fasting? He said, yes. And he said, and better than the salah? Subhanallah, better than making the salah, the prayer. And the Rasulullah said, and also better than giving the sadaqah. Yes, Ya Rasulullah, please tell us what's that? He said, Islahu Zatil Bain, to make peace between the Muslims' brothers if they had an argument, if they had any dispute among themselves. Islam focused on building the society because what society what's Islam based on you and me brother and sister you me her and him and her and so forth if we are the true Muslims and we are right in our society then the Islam will be built because we need to be an example to everybody else in this life first to our children to the people around us. So Islam focused to build a right society. You don't turn your back. You said, I don't care. Let them fight. And you can't do that. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, إِنَّمَا الْمُؤْمِنُونَ إِخْوَةِ Mu'mins are brothers. So make peace among themselves. 
Never turn your back. He said, I don't want any headache. I'm not ready for a headache. Let him fight. No. You need, you have some, you go get headache. But that for the sake of Allah, Allah will reward you. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us the messenger of peace and blessing. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. O oh, one who fasts, stand up in prayer at night and Allah will forgive, Allah will forgive.